In this video, I will use the mechanics of a violin to show how tension, length, and medium can change the fundamental frequency of a standing wave. First of all, what is a standing wave? A standing wave is a wave system where the medium has both fixed ends and fixed length so that the medium can only be disturbed between the two fixed points. Certain points along the medium called nodes will remain at rest at all times. Points called antinodes will oscillate with the maximum amplitude. Any other points will have amplitudes somewhere in between. Phenomenon is possible because there are two harmonic waves of equal amplitude, wavelength, and frequency moving in opposite directions along the same medium. When plucked, the strings of the violin can only oscillate with specific standing wave patterns. These patterns are called harmonics and can be seen in the image above. The name of the harmonic corresponds nicely with the number of antinodes so that the wavelength of the nth harmonic can be described as lambda equals 2L over N. Since frequency is equal to velocity over wavelength, we can find that the frequency of the nth harmonic is equal to N times velocity all over 2L, which is the same as saying N times the fundamental frequency. And when you think about a violin, you realize that it can play way more than just one note. Now we must ask ourselves how we can change the fundamental frequency to get all these different notes. If we think back to our equation, frequency is equal to n times velocity all over 2 times the length of the medium. We realize we need to change the length of the medium and or the velocity of the wave through the medium in order to change the frequency. However, we know that the velocity of a wave through a medium isn't dependent on the frequency of the wave, but the properties of the medium itself. So we must manipulate the medium, or the string, to create different sounds. We can do so by altering the string's tension by tuning, or by changing its mass density by using different strings for different notes altogether. We can also change the length of the medium by pressing down at different points along the length of the string. 